<laughs> Hi guys. So <clears throat> it's me, Brad, and I am so Bobby. amigos. So amigos 3OB, we just finished having uh, lunch at Ray's Drive-In. It was to me, I thought it was pretty good. What did you guys think? I thought it was a mall or something. <laughs> <laughs> so that? it looks like the hot sauce me mom have a deep voice because it got me too <laughs> anyways it was okay <laughs> it was okay <laughs> Well, let me go through OB. So today we're at Ray's Drive-In. It's a San Antonio West Side institution since 1956. Their hours of operation are from Tuesday through Sundays. Basically open from 11 a.m. to 10 p.m. Tuesday through Thursday. And their weekend hours, Friday and Saturday, are from 11 a.m. to midnight. Hello, amigos 3OB. So we are finally here in San Antonio in our hashtag Texication. Um, as you can see, Ethan is playing with his life because I've asked him to stop <laughs> touching the table like about four times and he keeps doing it. Um, so what we decided to do for lunch is we're here at Ray's Drive-In. It's on the west uh, side of San Antonio in the famous west side or infamous depending on how you look at it. Uh, so what is uh, Ray's famous for? Fluffy tacos. Fluffy tacos. So San Antonio is popular food is fluffy tacos. And what fluffy it is is... Tacos. Okay, fluffy tacos. Fluffy. Yeah, she said fluffy. I never said fluffy. Okay, puffy tacos. Puffy. Fluffy? Puffy. Fluffy. Is it puffy? Is it fluffy? <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, it's fluffy tacos. Uh, and you know, San Antonio is famous for it. Uh, it started out... Uh, as maybe a street food or has been here around for years. Uh, there's several locations, but from what we've heard is that Ray's is probably the best uh, puffy tacos in San Antonio. So as y'all can see, uh, we walk the area. It's very eclectic, very old fashioned. It's been here for a very long time. They actually still do it the old fashioned way where you can drive up, you honk the horn, where you flash the lights and it tells them to pull outside and they get your order. So we decided to come inside um, in the restaurant part. And, uh, it's raining outside. And it is raining That's too. So uh, if you want to know where it's at, obviously the website will be underneath. And it looks like our food is here. So Ethan, what did you get? Eat a beef with a puppy taco and mom? I got the combination of beef, chicken, and carne asada and rice and beans. Alright, so what I got is actually the same thing. So what I got was carne guisada, which is that. But this one I believe was chicken. And this one is ground beef. So as we were telling or saying, you see how the puppy tacos are? It's just basically a puffy tortilla. Uh, corn and this place also gives you free chips so we're gonna enjoy all right amigos through ob so we just got done having lunch here at ray's drive-in as you guys saw the puffy tacos that this place is famous for uh just out of the blue that some lady behind us was talking about because she was looking up on the internet how this is the number one place 
here in San Antonio for um, for puppy tacos. tacos. So they're really, really good. If you're ever here in San Antonio, make sure you make it come out here, do it as part of one of your meals. It isn't that expensive, but the food is worth it. I really enjoyed my tacos. I ended up giving Angie the chicken taco and I ended up uh, getting the two uh, carne guisada, which basically is stew meat, uh, and which I really, really enjoy. Ethan, what do you think of yours? Yeah, it's pretty good. It's pretty yeah, good? They put too much avocado. Uh, that's why we ask you if you wanted some. I know, yes. but they put too much. I didn't oh, know yeah. it. Because I don't think that he realized they were going to put the avocado sauce mix instead of the extra avocado. So they, oh, they get, put guacamole? Yeah. Oh, they did guacamole instead of avocado. Oh, okay, I get you. But and they um, didn't say that, so you have to be careful because if you have a kid that doesn't like it, then make sure they... So, and they that is it. true. Ethan actually likes the avocado when it's sliced, but as far as guacamole, he doesn't. It's the same thing, but for some reason he doesn't like it. <laughs> kind of the same way that Angie does not like refried beans, but likes regular beans, mm -hmm. which are the exactly same thing. Yeah, but it's not. But to them, it's not. <laughs> I, I don't get it. I, I like them either way. If you are new to our channel, make sure that you are subscribing. Uh, also, if you can, make sure you hit that notification bell. If you want to follow us on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, or Twitter, we're at three out and about. Uh, if you want to follow Angie just on her own or Ethan or myself, just use the names Johnny Blades, Angie Blades, or Ethan Blades, and you can find us on Facebook. You will not what? You will not be accepted. Well, I don't accept people that I don't know. Um, that defeats the purpose of YouTube. Yeah, that defeats the purpose of YouTube. Amazing, Mom. Amazing, Mom. Good job. So now we know who's keeping us from growing. So, okay. So anyways, I think God did that to you years ago. <laughs> <laughs> what exactly are we talking about growing though? <laughs> yeah, we're going to edit all this shit. Anyways, uh, <laughs> anyways, we want to thank you for joining us on this episode. We're definitely going to be filming some more from Six Flags and anywhere that this Texication uh, takes us. Definitely have uh, some things to do later on today with the family uh, that you guys are gonna get to uh, meet. But for now, I wanna thank you for joining us. Thanks, thank you for riding with us here to San Antonio today, and we hope you enjoy it. Adios, amigos 3OB.